play Take Me Home for Christmas. It's cold outside. chill hello everyone so it is officially the first of november today it's nine degrees it's getting dark outside at 4 15 and i'm pretty sure that officially means it's christmas am i right are you with me so we have our very first christmas video on the channel actually because i started the channel in january so i've never done a christmas video and this is really sorry excuse me just um keeping my eyes on the road being a safe responsible citizen anyway christmas i don't even actually need to tell you guys if you've seen any of my other videos autumn winter they're my seasons you know they are my seasons so we have a very first official christmas themed video today it's not going to be strictly christmas because i'm like right it's the first of november let's ease our way into this but I'm currently in the car driving. It's just me today, no Rue, no Kenny, just me and you. And I'm on my way to Ikea. I've been Pinterest boarding my life away when it comes to Christmas interior decor. And there's a few bits from Ikea that might not strictly seem Christmassy, but that I've got good ideas for. So I just thought I'd bring you guys along to Ikea today, really. Um, we'll have a bit of a shop, and then when we get home, I'll show you everything I picked up. Maybe even share a few little glimpses of my Pinterest board, show you what I'm thinking. There's just nothing that gets me more excited than a late night when it's dark, Ikea trip. Combine that with my first Christmas shop of the year. This is me genuinely in my element. Um, also, I got my nails done today, and if you've been watching my recent videos, you will know that is very overdue. I went for a brown, oh God. It's honestly getting borderline embarrassing, my obsession with brown. I'm wearing all brown today. I've got on the Zara tracksuit that I showed you guys in the autumn winter haul, and the Zara coat I showed you in the autumn winter haul. So if you've not seen that, and you're a brown autumn winter girl like me, go see that video we went really really short and then we just went with a dark brown i'm so happy with them i don't know if you guys can see the weather outside but it's just a perfect perfect evening to go christmas decor shopping kenny's currently at home with rue looking after her and he's cooking us something like cozy for dinner so when we get back i'll show you what we're having for dinner and then we'll get kenny's opinions on what i bought he's not the biggest christmas um person in the world and i had a genuine like serious talk with him when we were going to bed last night about this I was like, Kenny, if you want a future with me, I need to get you on board with Christmas because it's just my favorite thing in the entire world and I want to share that with Kenny. So we're gonna have to work on him this year, guys. Also this year, Kenny and I are hosting Christmas. Just because of Kenny's job, we can't go anywhere else. So we're going all out on Christmas this year. I just wanna make it really nice because last year was kind of like, I don't know, guys. I just feel like everyone was a bit worried about COVID and there was all the rules still in place and you weren't meant to stay over and all of that kind of stuff. So now that things are a bit more normal this year, we're going all out, all of the Christmas decor. So yeah, obviously I'm gonna make a million and one videos about it. You guys will be totally sick of me and Christmas by the end of it. Anyway, I'm gonna stop going on now and I will see you when we get to Ikea. Ariana Grande, Justin Bieber, Sam Smith, Michael Bublé, Mariah Carey, they own Christmas. They own Christmas. We've made it everybody. I listened to Christmas songs the whole way here and I've got absolutely no regrets about that. I don't want to hear any judgment on it. It made me feel very Christmassy and really got me in the mood for this shop. So, ta-da! Let's get inside. Just debating to myself whether I need a trolley, but I think the answer is definitely yes today. I am very relieved to see that literally in the entrance, they've already got gingerbread bits and pieces. Like this is looking very Christmassy to me, which is giving me high hopes for the rest of the shop. This looks and smells very Christmassy over here. 
These are quite cute, aren't they? I saw this online. I thought that was quite sweet. This is a bit like the desk chair I wanted to get, but the one I wanted has arms. And um, it's always out of stock. Right, this is more like it. We're getting a bit Christmassy in here. I think Ikea are doing Christmas trees this year. I don't know if they always do, but I saw it online. I really like these. Imagine them with like some mulled wine in, or even just a cup of tea. I think they're really nice. I might get two of them, actually. This is a nice cushion cover. It kind of looks, not very Christmassy, I know, but it kind of looks like that big clay type thing, but it's not. I actually saw this cushion cover online. I think that's really nice. Maybe fit in like the um, wicker basket now that it's Christmas. And then I've just seen this one. Could they be nice together? I don't know. What do you guys think? I'm definitely get, gonna get one of these though. That's really nice. Also, this is actually really quite nice, this throw. I'm gonna see if they've got any um, like Christmassy ones. Like this is better quality than or it looks better quality than the H&M one I ordered and sent back. To be honest, this room is very like cozy vibes. This is one of the things that I wanted to get another one of. I've got one of these in my bathroom, which you guys might have seen. I've got a really good Christmas idea for one of these. I will absolutely be getting some of this. We have this like every year in my family, just like the cranberry sauce with Christmas dinner. Is there anything better? Also, who knew? Organic, that is going in. I feel like this bedding's quite nice if you had like a son in a children's room at Christmas. Do you know what I mean? I mean, we're not quite there yet, but maybe one day. Right guys, now we're really talking. Also, just FYI, I'm pretty sure these are vegan, so. Oh, and then we have a big one. Oh, I can't eat these, but these are like my mum's favorite thing. They've got a few like Christmassy bits in the kitchen area, which are quite Christmassy. And then they've got some of these bits here. I'm not sure what this is. Oh, I think it's like a three thing of tins. And then I thought these were actually really sweet. They're just like little Christmas cupcake cases. Glasses, just some napkins, these old tins. I think this is quite nice, I don't know. What do you guys think? They've got this one too, which is also actually quite nice. I don't know. This one's 35 and this one's 45. I just think maybe Home Sense or somewhere might have nicer throws potentially. Right, I have picked up one of these. I think I only need one of those. And then what I'm currently debating is, does this cushion, would it go like this with my really big cushions? They do them in this like olivey green, which I actually think could be quite nice for Christmas potentially. We've got another little Christmas display here. Look at all of these. Is that a doorstop? I feel like that's a doorstop. That's quite funny. Look how good these are. You get a set of two. Here's the small one and here's the big one. And what I love about them is you can actually close them. Like all of my wicker baskets you can't close. We just don't have anywhere left in the house to put one. Like the whole house is filled with wicker baskets. If not, they would be coming home with me. They're really nice. These are like advent calendar gift bags. Aren't they so sweet? There's 25 of them for December. They've got loads of Christmas, like wrapping paper, some of this stuff, which is quite nice. Oh, they're like gift boxes. Yeah, they've really got all the, the big ones. If I had a 
fireplace, they would be coming home with me to decorate the fireplace. Maybe next year, guys. There's definitely nothing that says Christmas more than Harry Potter, so. Also, they've got some kind of like Christmassy doormats, like this one. Though we didn't really need a doormat living in an apartment, but they have some. Officially completed Christmas in Ikea. But can I just start by saying the bistro was closed. I, I thought about those meatballs, the plant balls and cranberry sauce for that entire shop and then it was closed. And you know when you've got yourself excited about food as well, my stomach's literally rumbling now. So I'm just putting home into the Thing. So, very quick debrief. I don't feel like Christmas in Ikea is in full force yet. There's a few things that I saw on the website that I couldn't find in there. So I didn't get that much, but what I did get, I'm really pleased with. So when we get home, I will show you and show Kenny at the same time what I got, and I'll show you guys what we're having for dinner. I hope it's ready. I'm so hungry. Let's get home. Hey Siri, play Take Me Home for Christmas. Best Christmas song ever. Okay, so I thought I'd show you and Kenny the stuff I got at the same time. Kenny is just over here cooking a shepherd's pie. Like I said, I didn't really get that much at all. I think maybe like mid-November they might have some more bits. So thing number one, I showed you this in there, is just this cushion cover. I am thinking, if you guys know my wicker basket that's down there next to the sofa, I think he would look really good on the cushion in that. What do you think? That was like Scottish carpet. It looks like Scottish tartan, yeah. Well, we're both a bit Scottish, so do we get the approval on that one? So next thing I got is just some of this wrapping paper. I thought it was really nice. They're like creams and browns. I don't know, they just kind of went together and I can see the, the presents underneath the tree and that. Then I got a couple of like Christmassy food bits. So I got some of the lingonberry, which I just, is so yummy. And then I got some of these orange thins. I can't say I've ever tried them before, but they're vegan, it turns out, and I just feel like they might taste Christmassy. As you saw in there, I also got another one of these that's the same thing that I have in my bathroom, but I have a vision for this on the, hmm, either on the kitchen island over there, or maybe on the cabinet here, and I'm gonna fill it with something Christmassy. I'll show you that when I like do my decorating. Then, as you guys saw as well, I just picked up two of these. They're not particularly Christmassy, but I just they were quite nice. They're like proper mugs, but glass. Oh. I thought they could be nice. And then everything else I picked up actually was not Christmassy at all. It was just really practical, like the drawer dividers and cushion padding and things like that. All in all, I would say like a three out of 10 for Christmassy, but that's okay, because I still felt very Christmassy doing it. And that is only Christmas shop one. I've already done a Zara home order, and then I'm thinking home scents. Home scents was amazing for my autumn stuff. I'm thinking Dunelm, because they've got some like tree baubles that I really want to go and look at. TK Maxx, that's always worth a look. Basically, we've got a lot more places to explore for Christmassy bit. And I'll take you guys along for that as and when I do that. Also today, I moved the fir tree diffuser into the living room, and it smells like pine trees and winter in here. This is such a nice one, if you guys haven't smelled it from the White Company. I've just poured myself a glass of wine. I'm gonna sit down, potentially watch The Grinch. The Grinch, the Dr. Zeus version, it has got to be my favorite Christmas film ever. Kenny, do you wanna hear my new favorite Christmas song?
Kenny and I are about to watch this found program on Netflix. Apparently it's really good. And I am going to make one of these hot chocolates. Honestly, these are the best hot chocolates in the entire world. Let me show you inside the packet, actually. This is what's inside the packet. So it's like actual chocolate. And then I just put it in my Nespresso milk frother. Or you can get the um, velvetizer to do it. But honestly, the milk frother does the exact same job. So I'm going to make one of those now. And then we're going to sit and watch this. And that will be us for the day. So I really hope that you enjoyed today's video. There's going to be so much more Christmassy content coming and you were excited about that <laughs> over the moon so i will see you guys on sunday with another wintry cozy potentially christmasy video have the best week guys it's all